The ocean may be hiding a lot of secrets, and it might be home to several of the most monstrous creatures on Earth, but rivers hide their own secrets and horrors. Day after day, things get thrown into rivers all around the world, and we remain clueless about their existence until the water decides to reveal them. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the most surprising and mysterious things found in rivers all around the world. From horrifying human bones to a man-eating crocodile, here are 15 bizarre things found in rivers no one can explain. Number 15. Human Bones Recently, a woman found something completely unexpected while walking along the banks of the Mississippi River. Since the beginning of 2022, drought has left its water levels incredibly low, revealing some of its parts that weren't visible before. The receding water revealed several bones. When the woman stumbled upon them, she never thought that they belonged to a person. The woman immediately called the authorities, who later on claimed that the remains included a jawbone, rib bones, and other unidentified pieces. There were no killings reported near the area, but authorities sent the remains to the state crime lab for further analysis. After all, the remains might be from a missing person. Needless to say, the woman named Crystal Foster never expected to stumble upon such a surprising discovery. She was originally looking for rocks with her family when she found the bones. Despite her initial shock, Foster said she hopes the bones bring answers and hopefully peace to the family of those who lost their loved ones. It might take a while before the bones are completely analyzed, but there's still a chance that the bones could solve one of the many missing person cases in the United States. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now. Number 14. Nazi Warship In September 1944, up to 200 German warships were scuttled near Prahovo in the Danube Gorge. The Nazis deliberately sunk their own ships on the orders of the fleet's commander as the Soviets rained down destruction on them. Nazi Germany tried to use the sinking boats as a last resort to stop the Soviets from advancing in the Balkans, but their plan didn't work. A few months later, Nazi Germany surrendered. Some of the scuttled ships were removed by the communist Yugoslav authorities right after the war ended in 1945, but several of the battleships remained. Today, we're still seeing remnants of the bloody battles that occurred in our history. Many of them can be found at historical sites worldwide, but some of them have been hidden over time. In 2022, drought revealed one of the many painful fragments of war. The ships that Germany deliberately sank in 1944 were exposed by the receding water, leaving it open for everyone to see. The emergence of the ships was a surprise, but aside from the painful reminder it gave, it also posed danger. The German ships were far from useful, but most of the ships still retained their turrets, command bridges, and most of all, unexploded munitions. Even decades after being scuttled, the explosives and ammunition on the ship still have the capability of exploding. The Nazi warships were hazards to local fishermen, as well as the marine life in the Danube. Although the exposed parts of the warships were a sight to behold, the authorities claimed it was necessary to remove them as quickly as possible. Number 13. River Beneath the Ice In most cases, finding a new body of water is considered a wonderful discovery, but this time, scientists are quite worried about what they found. In 2022, a team of researchers studying the Antarctic ice sheet discovered something beneath the frozen landscape. Scientists found a river longer than the Thames, stretching up to 285 miles and draining into the Weddell Sea. This under-ice river was almost undetectable, but ice-penetrating radar on an aircraft managed to see the entire system. This discovery is quite worrying. The melting ice could easily raise the seawater level by 14 feet worldwide. What's more, the presence of the river system could easily hasten the melting of the Antarctic ice sheet. Scientists are now analyzing how this under-ice river will affect changes in the Antarctic and the whole world. Number 12. East River Monster On May 21, 2011, locals walking near New York City's East River found the remains of a bizarre creature near the water. The seven-foot-long carcass resembled no known animal. It was long like a serpent and scaly like a fish, but its head resembled that of a pit bull. It looked like a confusing mixture of animals, and none of the onlookers could determine what it was. The remains were so confusing that people named the deceased creature the East River Monster. The discovery quickly became a sensation, and it wasn't long until the photo of the animal went viral on social media. 
with each person having their own wild guess as to what the creature was. Several people claimed that the creature was a monster from the deep sea, while some people insisted that the remains belonged to an alien creature. The theories became wilder and wilder until marine biologists claimed that the creature wasn't anything out of the ordinary. After seeing the remains themselves, experts were quite certain that the strange corpse belonged to a large Atlantic sturgeon. However, they claimed that it was quite sensible for people to mistake the creature for a monster. After all, the Atlantic sturgeon was rather bony for a marine creature. It's also one of the biggest and strangest freshwater fish in America. Today, the mystery of the East River monster is considered solved, but many believe that the remains found near the water that day belonged to a Kelpie-like creature. Number 11. Massive Ship It's not always that we find something valuable or significant when we travel, but from time to time, people all around the world discover some pretty amazing things. On October 2, 2022, a local hiker by the name of Patrick Ford was exploring the shores of the Mississippi River. A walk near the river was something he frequently did, and so he didn't expect that he would stumble upon something different. Patrick unexpectedly stumbled upon the remains of the SS Brookhill, a massive ship that sank in 1915. The ship only became visible because of the receding water levels caused by the prolonged drought that hit the country. The Brookhill ship was built in 1896, originally for trading and commerce. It was a great vessel that served its purpose until 1915, when it was sunk by a strong storm. After the incident, most of the ship was recovered, but several parts were never retrieved from the water. As a result, remnants of the ship remained in the river, waiting to be discovered. Experts noted that the discovery of the remains is quite incredible considering the Brook Hill ship is one of the few remaining boats that were built in the 1900s. Number 10. Roman Ruins The rising temperatures and the continuously decreasing water level revealed a magnificent ancient Roman military camp in what is now northwestern Spain. The record-breaking drought caused unbearable temperatures across the continent, but despite the scorching heat, many were quite impressed by what emerged from the water. Incredible arches, foundations, and columns were hiding beneath the waters in Spain all along. It was allegedly the remains of Aquis Carcinus, a historical landmark that served as a fort and military barracks for Roman legions a long time ago. The establishment was created as a shelter for soldiers monitoring the construction of roads in the area. The fort was occupied by the Romans until 75 AD when it was abandoned. The footage of the ruins was quite impressive, and it reminded many people how impressive the Roman civilization was at its peak. Number 9. Bronze Head This is the bronze head of Hadrian. He reigned as emperor of the Roman Empire from 117 to 138, and although he's not quite as known as Octavian or Augustus, there are still a lot of fascinating things about him. Hadrian succeeded to the throne in 117 AD, and one of the very first things he did was address the turmoil happening in the empire's northwest border. Hadrian decided to end the conflict between the border by building a massive wall, which was of course named after him. To this day, many of the Roman emperors are still considered mighty, but there aren't a lot of them that are recognized as good rulers. Hadrian was among the few rulers who devoted his life to ensuring the safety and well-being of his people. That's why when a bronze head statue of Emperor Hadrian was found in the River Thames in London in 1834, many people were amazed. But the question is, how did the Roman Emperor's head end up in London? Historians believe that the bronze head was originally part of a massive statue of Hadrian built to honor him during his visit to Roman Britain in 122 CE. When the head was found, it was already in poor condition. There was a noticeable crack in its hair on the left side, and signs of wear and tear were visible on the bronze head. Its pupils, which were originally made from glass, somehow got stripped away from the artifact. Another detail that confused experts is the way the bronze head was separated from its body. It was noticeable that the head was roughly hacked off from the rest of the bronze figure, but the reason behind this treatment is unknown to us to this day. Number 8. Hunger Stones In ancient times, people had a lot of beliefs. Back then, they believed in what the stars indicated and the omens left behind by nature. Today, we rely on science, but there will always be a part of us that will continue to believe in signs left behind by past civilizations. That is why several people were quite spooked by the hunger stones that revealed themselves in 2022, at the height of the major drought that affected Europe. As the water levels receded, stones bearing grim inscriptions appeared all across Europe. One of the horrifying statements includes, If you see me, then weep. 
These so-called hunger stones signify famine and starvation. As far back as 500 years ago, people from different time periods have used these stones as warnings and signs to prepare for hard times. The appearance of these stones signified poor harvest, famine, disease, and lack of food and water. It also foretold hunger, especially for the poor people who couldn't afford the high prices of food. The earliest readable stone dates back to 1616, but hunger stones from 1417 and 1473 were also uncovered. Most of the hunger stones bear terrifying inscriptions, but some are quite hopeful. For instance, one hunger stone in Blecked, Germany indicates, when this goes under, life will become more colorful again. Number 7. Ancient Bridge of Nero As one of the most popular figures of the Roman Empire, anything associated with the notorious tyrant and cruel ruler Nero is considered important. One of the most infamous Roman rulers, Emperor Nero ascended to power in AD 54 at the young age of 16. He became the emperor at a time when the Roman Empire experienced social and political change. He oversaw Rome during the Great Fire and Boudicca's rebellion in Britain. Recently, one of the structures he ordered to be built revealed itself when the worst drought in 70 years hit Italy. The low water levels exposed the piers of an ancient bridge that was built over the Tiber River. It was once used by Roman emperors, but it ultimately fell into disrepair sometime in the 3rd century. Historians claim that the bridge was most likely ordered by Nero to be built so that he could easily cross the river and reach his gardens. The first portion of the bridge always becomes visible during the dry season, but because of the drought, the second portion of the ancient bridge emerges from the water after a long time. Number 6. Dinosaur Tracks Europe wasn't the only continent that was affected by a record-breaking drought. Several parts of the United States were also affected, and just as how the scorching temperature caused bodies of water in Europe to recede, rivers, reservoirs, and lakes across the country also experienced a decrease in their water levels. In 2022, drought conditions brought the Paluxy River water level extremely low, but it revealed magnificent dinosaur tracks that were hidden beneath the water. After analyzing the tracks, Experts claim that the ancient dino footprints were more than 100 million years old. These weren't the only dinosaur fossils found in Dinosaur Valley State Park in Glenrose, Texas, but it was definitely an unexpected find. The tracks belong to a variety of dinosaurs, including a carnivorous reptile named Archocanthosaurus. It's a creature that existed between 115 to 105 million years ago, in the early Cretaceous period. Footprints of the massive Sauroposeidon were also found around the park. This creature was the behemoth with a height equivalent to three giraffes stacked on top of each other. Many footprints and dino tracks can be found around the park, but according to park officials, the footprints will be gone as time passes by. Erosion and weathering will soon erase the marks left behind by the magnificent reptiles. Number 5. Drought Reveals 3,400-Year-Old City Whenever the water reveals its secrets, archaeologists always need to race against time to get a closer look at the artifacts it hides. In June 2022, the sweltering temperature in Iraq set the Tigris and Euphrates River yet again to an all-time low. Lack of rainfall, pollution, and poor management further decreased the water levels of the two river systems and caused many of the locals a loss of livelihood. However, the drought revealed something astounding, a 3,400-year-old city a part of the river showed the remains of a major city in the Mitanni Empire that dates back to around 1350 BCE. According to the locals, many of them learned about the ancient city when a dam was constructed near the two river systems in the 1980s. However, the buildings and artifacts were never investigated or studied by archaeologists. For this reason, many of them rushed to see the ruins after hearing about it. The ruins have only been visible several times since they became submerged in the 1980s. In 2018, the 22-foot walls of the ancient city briefly showed themselves as the country was hit by a major drought. At the time, archaeologists weren't prepared. That's why archaeologists prepared when drought struck again. After studying the ruins, many were amazed at the sheer brilliance of the Mitanni Empire. The remains of the city showed signs of massive structures as well as artifacts, which included five ceramic vessels with over 100 cuneiform tablets. Archaeologists think that the tablets may be letters, if this is the case, these ancient artifacts might be the key to learning more about the ancient empire that reigned in the land hundreds of years ago. And now, it's time for today's topic. 
About 6,000 years ago, the Tigris and the Euphrates River became the key places that supported the cradle of ancient Mesopotamian civilization. The Euphrates River in particular is one of the longest rivers in West Asia, and also one of the most significant. This river system stretches 2,800 kilometers long, and its history is just as expansive. In the 4th millennium BC, the water of the Euphrates River gave birth to the first civilization, Sumer. Many ancient cities relied on the blessing of Euphrates to live, and it was one of the reasons why Mesopotamia flourished. The river provided a way to irrigate the soil and support the Babylonian and Assyrian empires for years to come. The Euphrates has seen many battles since the dawn of the Mesopotamian civilizations and remains to be a significant river system. That's why scientists' terrifying new discovery in this river shocked the entire world. This part of the Tigris-Euphrates basin was once bigger and had more water, but what remains today is a thin line, as seen in this photo captured by NASA. There will come a point when there won't be enough water in the basin to float a canoe properly. Extreme weather conditions and pollution will worsen the condition of the Euphrates, and there might come a time when the river that gave life to the brilliant civilization in the past will cease to exist. As always, comment down below with the hashtag today's topic and let us know your opinion about what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Number 4. Unexploded World War II Bomb Another bizarre thing that the drought in Italy revealed was an unexploded bomb that was originally from the Second World War. After several heat waves swept Europe, the waters in Italy's River Po became so low that they revealed the dangerous bomb. It was quite an unexpected find, and it was also incredibly dangerous. Shortly after the locals noticed the bomb, authorities immediately responded to the scene. Military experts quickly defused it and carried out a controlled explosion to get rid of it. After all, unexploded bombs and munitions from World War I and II are considered hazards. They contain unstable gunpowder and other substances that could easily blow up. They could not only destroy property, but also claim the lives of people within the vicinity. Luckily, fishermen who originally noticed the bomb in the water decided to leave it alone and let the authorities decide what needed to be done. If they touched the bomb, there was a huge chance that they could accidentally set it off and cause a destructive and deadly explosion. Clearing the bomb wasn't an easy task. With thousands of people around the area where it was found, the military force needed to proceed with extreme caution. It took some time before the locals agreed to move away temporarily. In the end, the authorities persuaded the people to follow protocol and stay away until they were done with the controlled explosion of the bomb. Number 3. Witch Bottle In the 17th century, people in Europe feared witchcraft. At the time, there was a belief that several people dabbled in dark magic and that these individuals could easily cast malicious spells onto anyone they wanted. That's why people started to protect themselves by carrying witch bottles. Witch bottles were considered counter-magical items that protected someone against witchcraft. It might sound like a great item to have, but the contents inside the bottle were often grim. For instance, a witch bottle discovered in the walls of an old pub in England revealed quite a strange and disgusting concoction. A liquid that seemed like human urine, human teeth, and all sorts of other strange things were mixed inside the bottle. Recently, a man exploring the bank of the Mississippi River stumbled upon a witch bottle. Originally, he was using his metal detector to find Civil War artifacts. That was why he was somewhat perturbed when he picked up the old bottle and inspected the contents. Inside, he found an unknown liquid, as well as human hair, tiny insects, and a tooth. The man decided to take the witch bottle back home which clearly made his housemates unhappy. None of them were amused by the discovery, and they all encouraged the man to return the strange artifact back to where he found it. Number 2. Thousands of Dollars There really are just some lucky people out there. In April 2022, a teenage treasure hunter was combing river bottoms using a heavy-duty magnet when he landed on something completely unexpected. He discovered a massive safe. He had no idea what was inside until he tried to bust it open. Needless to say, he was pleasantly surprised by what he found. The 15-year-old treasure hunter discovered a small pouch inside the safe. Inside the pouch were colorful Australian dollars that amounted to 2,500 Australian dollars, or around 1,800 US dollars. However, money wasn't the only thing inside the safe. The teenager also discovered a certificate and expired bank cards all under the name of Rob Everett. Instead of taking the money for his own, the 15-year-old boy decided to do what was right. Along with his father, 
The boy tracked down the owner of the safe and returned everything back to Rob. After hearing about the news, Rob, who was a business owner in Grantham, was incredibly touched by the sincere action of the father and son duo. He claimed that he was amazed by the effort exerted by the two just to track him down, even though there was no need for them to do so. The safe was allegedly stolen from him some time ago, and he had already lost hope that he would ever reclaim the money or his cards. Rob said that the boy could have easily taken the money and left all the other things in the river, but the two did what was right. Rob gave the father and son duo a small reward and even offered the teenage boy a job after he finished his studies. Number 1. Man-Eating Crocodile In most cases, crocodiles eating entire humans sounds impossible. Sure, they're perfectly capable of doing so, and in remote areas around the world, crocodiles grow large enough to swallow an adult human. The notion that a croc would eat you alive sounds like something from a cliché occult movie. That is, until it actually happens in real life. In April 2022, a 20-year-old man who visited his relatives in the Circe and Perva village was eaten by a massive crocodile. The man allegedly went into the river to relieve himself, not knowing that the vicious reptile lived in the water. Villagers rushed out to save him, but it was too late. The deadly beast had already gotten a hold of him, and he was dragged into deeper water. The thing is, these crocs live in rivers all around the world. That's why if you're ever near an unknown body of fresh water, make sure that you're alert. You never know, the jaws of a powerful beast might grab your limbs and drag you to deeper water. These discoveries are quite surprising, but there's no doubt that there are a lot more things left undiscovered in rivers all around the world. Before you go, make sure to share your thoughts about the most surprising discovery featured in this video. If you found any interesting items in a river before, make sure to share your story in the comments down below as well. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.